out to my channel. I'll come back with another one. May the 23rd, Tuesday. I said I was going to come back with another one in the afternoon. I think it's like 624. Whatever. I said, I might go back. I might go to bed and do another one tomorrow, uh, Wednesday. And see how I feel. Because I was tired. Um, let's see. What's the message? Okay. Heavens. Ancestors, Ascendant Masters. Oh, what is this? I'm not taking. Oh, give me the message. Please and thank you. For all those talking about. Oh, oh you don't get your message from Tori. And listen, bitch. Whoever you are. Because I know you're watching. We don't have to listen to you. Okay? And I know you're a part of this group and this organization, too. Okay? Everybody know they get their message intuitively, okay? Not just by cards. So if you if you directly like message to a particular somebody, then say so. All that subliminal in them, all that subliminal shit that you're doing. I know who exactly who who's saying that. Oh, and, you know, just listen. I don't give a damn who you pray to or who you worship. But when heaven tell me to do something, the way I do it is the way we fucking do it. Everybody else has their own fucking missions and gifts that they use and, and utilize on their own journey. You don't outcast anybody. Oh, this is a, maybe this is all they know. Who the fuck is you? And you ain't even all that. Oh, you old hat. Sorry for all the old people, but this is one particular goddamn bitch on 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 social media. She does that shit all the time. No disrespect to my old people, but it's just one goddamn bitch. Everybody got their own gift and your own unique um, talent. You're not just one way, oh, you gotta be in tune. I be tuned all day, every day, bitch. And so is my collective. And I know you're watching. I hate when people do that, collective. I hate that. The first card, star, collective, star, all right? Yes, this could be a query, it don't have to be society leadership, taking the leadership, all right? Um, you star, collective, you, some of you guys take what resonates, okay? Masculine and feminine. Um, you are in spiritual nature. You, 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 you are one of the stars in the cosmic. So where many, 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 many lives ago, when we started off as stardust, when you went on fireballs, you was, was one of the many of the stars that the elders will choose you. Who was you? I'm one of them. So a lot of you, you, you are like star seeds or stardust from the cosmics. Okay. And this is you using your gift, whatever it is, you might be, your gift might be, you know, you love, or your gift might be inspirational, your gift might be, you know, you are a motivational speaker, your gift might be whatever it is, okay? Whatever it is, you are illuminated things, star shining bright, Okay, this is like a wish coming true. This is not for everybody, but for some. And if it doesn't, if it's not for you, just take the message as it resonates, right? I feel like some of you guys, because you are a star, you will be you will be feeling abandonment, some kind of abandonment. You got to know why you feel in some kind of abandonment as being a star or chosen or a light or healer or whatever, whatever uniqueness you have. You're going to feel some abandonment in, in your journey, period, all right? But I feel like you got a lot of hope. You're in the right direction, all right? Um, you're being hopeful and inspired, Right? I feel like you are following your path, all right? You are healing, right? You will find some inner clarity about your, yourself. You are a star individually, white, black, whatever, the, whatever. Male, male, masculine, feminine, young or old. You are a star. You just got to shine and bring it out within you. You might teach me something. Don't, don't, don't be too shy to leave a comment 
in the comments because I need to learn from you too. You know, we transmute energies and learn from each other because you might be a bright star. I'm like, damn, I learned from so and so and so, and I never knew. Maybe I never know. I'm like, damn, thank you. Help each other in that way, right? And this is also uh, miracles. You are aligning with the star, heavens, the ancestors, the spirit. I don't listen to no man down here. None. Not even you. Whatever you believe in, it is whatever it is. Okay? And it, 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 whatever. Okay? But heavens, the send us, sending masters, is a lot of you are, are along with me are stars. You are born a star. And you need to shine. Okay? And this is, is this is the heavens is is working and cohesion with some of you guys to bring your wish into fruition. Meaning it's going to come true, but you got to know how to handle it. Okay? That's the first card I came with. Eight. This means new beginnings. Okay? This means abundance. Okay? This means prosperity, prosperity and financial well-being. Okay, this is manifestation. All right, you are a star. You can manifest, right? Off of your energy, your whatever it is. Where break your light alone, right? This is movement. You know, like the uh, 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 wishing on the star, the wishing star, right? This is change. All right, this is infinity. Okay, this is good karma. This is represent the strength card as well. So basically, eight. Star, because that number eight is abundant. 17, break it down to eight. Okay. Keep it short. I didn't like what that what that person said. Um, you feel making people feel like, oh, w w what if that's the only goddamn gift that the universe, I mean the heavens told them to use? You don't chastise guy or to cast out anybody else because you, you want to be in tune. You're not even all that in tune. And I know that you, whoever that is, that lady is, you talk to demons. You are a part of a cult. You're not a real one. You be checking my channel out. Stop um, getting on people about, oh, not, oh, don't use this term. Maybe they have to. Maybe they're not tapped in like, you know, some of us tapped in. Three of Cups. This is telling me that you have some friends or community um, that's supporting you. Rejoice in your celebration because you are that star, okay? It's all about your creativity, three, right? It's all about communicating, communication, all right? I do feel like this could be a separation from you and, and a person or a collective. It don't have to be you. It could be somebody else. I feel like you can celebrate. Yes, you could. Don't don't drink too much. Don't overindulge too much. This is also about change a partner. Okay? The three of cups represent change partner. This is about happy home and family. Okay? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, and three represents numerology, communication, harmony, okay, luck and success. This is using your intuition, the divine principles. It's about wisdom, self-expression, right, um, the outcome, and your growth. Remember, you're in the healing Remember how I told you what the star represents as well, healing, okay? You could be, you have some healing um, gifts, or you could be a healer or whatever. You don't have to be a healer. You just could, you just have a, a, a gift, right? But that's what three represents as well. It's about your growth. This is relationship as well, right? Initial success, the Empress um, a world card and hangman, okay? The three, hangman, world card, and Empress as well, right? Let me get one more. Oh, I'm in. Damn. Okay. Uh, uh that's too many cards. They thought they were gonna get me. They was out there talking shit, collecting. They thought they were gonna get us. I represent, and I have your collective back. Okay. 
And it's, it's, it's a shame because it's the same thing that I experienced last year for the past couple of years. And it's a repeat in the same thing every year, every month, every day, every week, if you can remember. And I hate when these people be talking all that shit. They have the most ugliest clothing in the stores. I'm like, who go? You know what? Disrespectful. Page of Pentacles. Okay. This is telling me that um once again, this represents karma. The tenth house, earth sign, Capricorn. This is a house of leadership. You don't have to be a Capricorn. You can just be embodied of that energy, right? I feel like this is a younger energy. This is youthful. You could be youthful. All right? This is a new path. Here we go again. Remember with the three of um, cups here? And a new beginning with the, with the, with the, with the, um, the star card? This is a message, okay? Um, I feel like some of you guys, this could be a new job or raise. It don't have to be. But this is this is something new. This is manifestation. Mm -hmm. You could be working on a new enterprise. I feel like you need to plan ahead to pursue your goals, okay? This is your new skills or a new direction. And I feel like whoever this person is in your circle, try to take your energy, your place, and try to create something new off of your energy, off of your destiny, off of your status, off of your fucking position. That's what I'm thinking. And that's making that's getting me hella hot. Because I don't play with people, play with people like this. I'm very passionate about what I do. And people going about playing in people's life. And situation pisses me off. Take leadership. I won't let y'all down. As long as I'm alive. See what I'm saying? You ain't gonna have another have a real one like this, man. For real, for real. It's the bottom of the deck. Seven of Cups. This could be like options, okay? We um choose wisely, okay? It's about confidence as well. All right. So let me get some more cards off of this. Spirit, give me um some more cards off of here. It's going to be a little longer. You have the three uh, pinnacles in reverse. Oh, you can't see. So what I'm getting here is, so who's in a business deal or anything like that? No. Remember, you have skills here. Okay, you have a new job or new raise right now. And what spirit and what heavens and what the else and the master spirit is telling me is not now, not right now. For me too. This is my message with you guys as well. Not right now. This is three, 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 three of pinnacles. No. Okay, not for me. Okay, and, and, and if it's for you, then I, I feel like you should use your discernment. You see what I'm saying? You see, I got a worried look on my face. Use your discernment. Okay. I feel like this is a waste of time. Um, the three of um pinnacles. I feel like it's a lack of uh, integrity, lack of ambition. It, it's some delays here. This is this is this is um imbalance. Um, uh, mal amount for I want to say malfunctioning, imbalance, and um de unorganized or unorganized. You will be disappointed here. I feel like if you cahoots with this third party or somebody trying to make you to be a third party and take your skills and your gifts and your ideas and your creativity on somewhere else, you will be disappointed. It's like robbing you, you know what I mean? Blind. Robbing you blindsided. Okay, collective? Because you do have the moon card with the three of cups here. With cancer in the fourth house, this is dealing with family and, and home, but also and stability as well. But moon, you already know when the moon card comes, when the moon is that's something hitting. That's 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 that's, that's um this, some kind of deception, right? Some emotions, okay? When you're dealing with cancer, maybe their home, their family, their children, their wife or their baby mama or, or father or mother or whatever, you know what I mean? 
but they want to come and mess with you guys, all right? We had the, uh, oh, see, this is not good. Well, dropped on the floor with the Ten of Pentacles. And this is dealing with your inhabitants. This is the prosperity. Remember, you the star. Manifestation. This was going to drain you of your resources. Right? Unexpected change. If you would have, with this three of um, pinnacles here. Remember, the top row is good. But the only pro problem is the three of pinnacles here. And then the ten of pinnacles in reverse. This is unbalanced. This is this is losses. This is this is financial losses. Okay, bankruptcy, right? Disaster, right? And I feel like this is also a lack. See, all is a lack of motivation because you are the star. You the light. It's it's your energy. It's your light. All is lack of of ambition. Lack of motivation. That's why they want to come around you, collective us. Problem with a large corporation or the government. Yeah, this is not good. Somebody could be uh, a part of a, 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 a organization. And you ain't going to like it. So, no. Um, this is not a good idea. It's not a good idea. I mean... It's not a good idea to cahoots with anybody else right now. Do your own thing. Because right now it's finances. It's, it's gonna be out the out the door. The money is not gonna come in like the what like that. You the star, you got money, your wishes coming true, however it is, however it is, however the heavens or a, a, sin, a sin spirit or the ascended masters is blessing you with, or the Holy Ghost, or whatever the fuck you want to say, right? You know how I am. I don't touch down no, okay. So This is not even the three. The three of pentacles is um, not a teamwork. See, here we go. It's the second card. Let me the star. Thank you, uh, spirit. So this is like I said. This is a this is recognition. You are getting. You got. You are being seen as a star in the in, in the community. You are inspiration. Okay. You have a see. There we go. That like creativity, right? Three of cups. Creativity. Three represent creativity as well. All right? You, it's all about your creativity here. Your spirituality. Some of you guys may be religion. All right, fine, cool. Whatever. And it's all about your faith and your belief. Whatever it is that you believe in. Like I said, I, I believe in spirituality. You might be religion. Whatever. How am I dealing with that? You already healing. You already healed. You are directly in alignment with your path and what's destined for you. You have the faith in your future. You know your future. You know what your future holds. Some of you guys, not everybody, take what resonates. It's about your happiness, okay? Your happiness. This is a promise from the above. That's because somebody didn't come and fulfill your dreams or your wishes that they... Okay, this is a promise that the heavens is ordaining for some of you guys out there, and ladies and, and gentlemen, right? Because obviously so, a man or somebody didn't come through and fulfill their promises. This is a promise that the heavens and your ascended masters and spirit is working on a lot of you behalf without even knowing. Some of you is going to have to wait. Until it's your turn. You're getting help. Who? Oh, spirit. In the flesh, spirit, in the spiritual realms. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, sweetheart. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. All right? I know I'm going... I know I should leave it off like this, right? You got the, the chariot, the villain. They want to come in... Oh, you can't see. From the villain card. It's a 100 Dalmatian lady. You see? There we go. I had to turn like that so you can see. Yeah, on top of the deck. Look, yeah, they're coming. They want to come in. Mess your, 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 your structure. Your, your, your abundance. You know what I'm saying? That's how, that's how they looking. That's how they looking at you like. 
Like secretly envy you, secretly looking at you like, you coming back on, don't be, don't be phony. That's how they wanna, I'm gonna fuck this, I'm, I'm gonna mess your shit up. Oh yeah? Okay, we'll see about that. We'll see about that. You feel me? Because this two of cups is in reverse. Now, no love. Okay? This is imbalance. Okay? This is, this is not equal. It's not, like I said, it's not teamwork with the three of uh, pinnacles. This is, this person is incapable of uh, making your dreams or wish coming true. So you got to do it for yourself and you got to wait on spirit. You got to wait on the heavens. You got to wait on your ascended masters. You got to put in work as well. Don't just let it sit there and let everybody, you know, do it. No, you got to do your part, right? You will be unhappy in a situation with the three, or with the two, the two uh, um, cups in, in reverse. This is, this is, this is not a, a, a spiritual union. And if it's a soulmate, it's a karmic soulmate. That's why you won't be happy. Okay? There's a lot of things on, on them like, oh, yeah, your twin flaming, your karmic in it. I mean, your twin flaming and your soulmate, but they don't tell you that it's, 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 it's a karmic soulmate. It's a, it's a karmic um, twin flame. It's a karmic divine being. And I'm not going to sit up here and say, oh, yeah, no, 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 no. It's a goddamn karmic. Okay, you see that? Can you see? Two of cups in reverse. Okay. You're not going to be happy. It's the same old, same old. You're just not going to be happy, all right? And ain't nobody going in the upper room. You ain't got the power or, or the authority to. Justice in reverse. I don't know why these cards coming up in reverse. See, this is imbalance. Is it right? Injustice. Is car <gasps> karmic. Retribution. Dishonesty. Corruption. Lack of accountability. They want to take accountability for they for they want to do. They want to put it on you and us. Unfairness. Karmic avoiding. They trying to avoid their karmic debt. But we ain't responsible for that collector. Like I want to punch him in the face for y'all. Like, I can't stand this energy. I really can't. No, 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 collective. No, no. My men, my handsome men, and my beautiful women out there, my beautiful men and, uh, and beautiful women. No. Because whatever this, I feel like this is a past situation and you wanted to reconcile and make it work, but spirit is telling me, because this is my story as well, because I'm a, I'm a part of the collective with you guys, right? Um, don't, don't, right? No, all right? And yeah, because it's the seven of cups. It's, 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 you have an option. These people, whoever this is, have options. It's a dream, it's a fantasy, it's an illusion, all right? It, 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 they, they, I feel like whatever, whoever this is, is 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 just living in illusion. Okay, it's not even real. It's a lack of. It's a lot of options they have, choices, m multiple uh, possibilities, or multiple uh, partners, partners still. All right, uh, picking and choosing, and you know, it's just it's just dreaming, it's fantasy, it's illusion, it's wishful thinking. It's a, they, I feel like it's an hallucination, but you because you're the star, it feel like you can't make their dream come true. What by bumping? Mm. Bumping you out of here. I'm going to do another reading. Um, tomorrow is Wednesday, right? The 24th, right? Yeah, I'm going to do a reading tomorrow as well. I need to get some sleep because I didn't really sleep that good at all. And I wanted to... um. Yeah, see? Page of, um, but you got good news coming in. You got the page of uh, wands here. It's a yes. You got good news coming in after all of this, all right? Once you follow, once you, once you, once you follow, once you, once you follow your right path or make a decision, right? You have good news coming in, okay? It wants you to be, um, have some courage, okay? And also stay optimistic, optimistic, Okay? Um, it could be some competition with you in, in it or or whoever this is, is is competing. All right. I feel like you are faithful to your journey, you're true to yourself, which is a good thing. 
All right, you are courageous. And I also feel like you have some energetic, because this is this is this um a page is a young energy. Okay, just say young. It's a female, but it's a young energy. So it's you. You are very energetic, or you got some any any energy, right? Or this person sought out a younger energy here. All right, go ahead, buy bounce. You know what I'm saying? Bounce. I feel like this person could put on an act, could act. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like some of you guys are inspiration speaker with the ones or performer or um, some kind of coach or something. And this is also being inspired, you know, new path here. This is good news. After all, after the, the three of uh, pentacles, the ten of pentacles in reverse, the two of cups in reverse, and the justice card in reverse, and the seven of um, cups, this is good news coming after. Once you just avoid all of that, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. Okay? They thought they were going to give me this time because I remember this played out last time, last year. So, no. Okay? So... Uh, this is enthusiasm, right? You are very um, cheerful, already excited of this new beginning of this new path here is what I'm getting. I am. I am. All right? So, let's get one more card. Oh, I should leave it like that. Yeah, stay on your ground. The seven of wands. Protect, protect what's yours. Stand up for your belief. All right? Take control. Maintain control. Okay? Be very territorial. I feel like this person is very territorial about these wands. And I feel like you they it owns you and you there. No, ain't nobody oh, we not a cattle. We ain't brand or marked. I, I mean, I ain't got no tattoo or anything. I'm not brand or marked, but anyway. <laughs> This is protective. I, I feel like your protection is being protected. Or somebody could be protecting you. Somebody could be opposing. Um, this opposing energy against some individual and one person came in and kind of blocked that for you. All right? Could be spirit. Somebody. Yeah, because it's an entrapment. The, the um... The eight of swords on the bottom of the deck. Yeah, you wasn't you wasn't seeing it, you know, or we wasn't seeing it because this one this this was a trap, this was set up, all right. And this would have got would have put you in, you know, isolation, and you would have been have you would have felt powerless in a situation that you can't get out of, all right. And some and some this could be imprisonment, okay. Some could be going to prison, all right. This is definitely um punishment here as well. All right, or try to make you a slave to whatever it is that they want you to do. You know, worshiping them, and you know, you know, you know how how it is. You know, submit to them. This is this is what they want to do. They want to restrict you, restrict you from the popularity from the community. All right, because whoever it is, they are burning. They are burning with a lot of responsibilities. All right, and now they've been defeated. So whatever that is, the ending, the ending, the ending. It's been defeated with the Ten of Swords, all right? Because you are an earth angel or you're here to bring balance and, and um, justice in a situation as well. You are an earth angel. You have power. Ain't nobody going to do anything to you. Even when they try. You tell that motherfucking devil, not today. Not today, not tomorrow, never. Okay? Collective, that's your reading. I'm going to come back tomorrow. I'm going to get some welcome time. And take a nap and go to sleep. Because I came in like, what time I came in? Like five something, right? In the afternoon, now I went to take a shower because my face, I got tan and everything. And I'm like, woo wee, but whatever. And lay down. So I hope you enjoy this message, okay? Remember, you the star. You star. I don't give it, I don't give a damn what your nationality is. Uh you start, all right? Shine like a diamond, okay? And I'll come back tomorrow with another one, all right? Peace and stay safe.